have you ever seen a bird splashing around in the water? It's taking a bath, but why? Let's dive in and look at the reasons why birds might take baths. The surface of feathers looks clean and smooth, glossy, light, and well, feathery. Feathers are made of keratin, the same material as hair. Under those feathers, a bird is hidden. This bird needs to stay clean. Let's go back to looking at birds with their feathers on, but remember that this bird is inside those feathers. Their skin is constantly regrowing and replacing itself. This helps repel microorganisms from living on the skin. New skin cells grow up from the lower skin layers. Old skin cells flake off at the surface and end up mixed into the feathers. Next, some types of birds have powder down, a specialized type of feather that breaks into little fragments to make the other feathers waterproof. Those fragments build up over time, mixed into the feathers. Most birds without powder down have preen oil. They keep their feathers waterproof by spreading oil all over their feathers. They later eat some of that oil to get vitamin D, but the rest builds up in the feathers along with whatever dirt or dust sticks to it. There are also mites and other very small animals which are 100% completely adapted to live in bird feathers. Some are harmless and just eat the feather dust and oil. Some are parasitic and feed on blood. Either way, the bird needs to keep these under control. Birds have found a way to solve some or all of these problems at the same time. The bath. Birds can bathe by standing in water and dunking their feathers. They ruffle open all their feathers to let water get in towards their skin. They flick water up on their backs. Or like this goose, they get their backs wet more directly. If a bird can't get to a pool of water, they will also take dust baths, which is doing very similar motions to get dust in between the feathers. Then shake it out. There are several theories as to what bathing does. Water is certainly rinsing away feather particles and loose skin. Dust probably does the same thing by binding with oil and making clumps that the bird can shake away. Water or dust probably make life harder for mites. Hopefully it washes them away, but at the very least it will make them wet or dusty and slow them down for a while. But for how common bird baths are, there has been no scientific experiment which has locked down exactly why birds take baths. We can just speculate for now. If you're looking for a research question about birds, this one is just waiting for you to go find the answer. This video relied on bird bathing footage from Koa Nature on YouTube. He's a really funny guy with an evolutionary biology degree, so if you want to see funny and educational videos about wildlife, you can see them on his channel. Here's a good video to start with, and the channel link is here and in the description. You can also subscribe here before you go. Thanks for stopping by this week to learn what makes life awesome.